So if I want to create a calendar with a spreadsheet, I'm going to do Sunday, Monday, and I'm going to highlight those and grab the corner and drag it over. And so today is June 9th, 2013, and tomorrow will be June 10th, 2013. And I'm going to highlight that, grab the corner, and pull it over. So I've got the dates. And actually, I'm going to do it this way. I'm going to say this equals this date plus 1. Because that way, if I want to update this, I just have to change the first date. So if I make this, I don't know, 2, 4, then all the rest of the dates will update. So I'll just do this as 6, 9, and then I have all the rest of the dates in the list. Okay, then I'm going to skip a line because I want this to be some sort of calendar going to use like for lesson planning. So then I'm going to say that this equals the previous date plus 7. So it's 7 days from now. And I will click on that cell and I will grab the corner and fill that across. And then what I will do is I'll highlight this along with the uh, blank row so that I pick up that pattern and I just pull the list down. Um, so now I have a whole entire calendar uh, that I can now start filling in for lesson plans. So what if though I want to make this a list in um, a Google form, right? So I can put equals transpose. Now I only I'm going to use this for my school, so I only need Monday through Friday. So I'm going to highlight Monday through Friday here. I'm going to transpose those dates. Boom, enter. This equals transpose, and then I'll do the second week, just Monday through Friday, and I'll put equals tran. Oops, transpose, and then I'll get the third week, Monday through Friday. And pretend, you know, like this summer school, right? Equals transpose um, Monday through Friday. Get equals transpose Monday through Friday. So we'll just say this is like a short summer school class, right? So then I'm going to highlight all of the dates that I just created. I'm going to copy that. So then I come over to my Google Form. And I'm going to create, say, multiple it doesn't matter, multiple choice, check boxes, choose from a list. And I just kind of highlight in the first choice and I push paste and it automatically paste it in all of the dates into my questions. So then I can say, what day of the week is it? You know, whatever. I can, you know, use this for taking attendance or whatever I want to do.